Do these proofs with respect to the convolution integral and the input signal x of n is linearly convolved with the impulse function del of t, the output is input signal itself that is x of t. Similarly, second proof is when input signal x of t is linearly convolved with the time shifted impulse function, then output is that is time shifted input signal x of t minus t naught. Similarly, input signal x of t is linearly convolved with the unit step function u of t and the output is integral of minus infinity to plus t x of tau into d tau. Again the fourth one is when x of t is linearly convolved with time shifted unit step function that is u of t minus t naught the output is integral of minus infinity to t minus t naught x of tau into d tau. Let us take the first one that is x of t is linearly convolved with del of t. You know the form that is integral formula integration of minus infinity to plus infinity x of tau into del of t minus tau into d tau. As for the definition of impulse function del of t equals to 1 when t is 0. Similarly that is del of t minus tau equals to 1 when t minus tau is equal to 0 from this I can write that t is equal to tau. This exists at only one value of tau that is tau must so one value of t that t must be equal to tau or tau must be equal to t that means I can write that this exists at only at one value that is x of t. Second one x of t is linearly convolved with del of t minus t naught that is integral of minus infinity to plus infinity x of tau del of t minus t naught minus tau into d tau from the definition of impulse function del of t minus t naught minus tau that is equal to 1 when t minus t naught minus tau is equal to 0 from this from this you can write that that is tau must be equal to t minus t naught that means it exists only at one point the tau must be equal to t minus t naught tau is replaced by t minus t naught this will become one the answer is x of t minus t naught next third proof that is x of t is linearly converted with u of t that is integral of minus infinity to plus infinity x of tau into u of t minus tau into d tau as per the definition of unit step function u of t minus tau is equal to 1 when t minus tau is greater is greater than or equal to 0 that is t is greater than or equal to tau that is nothing but tau is less than or equal to t that means integral limit here is upper limit is small t because tau cannot be greater than t lower limit is minus infinity that is integral of minus infinity to t x of tau into d tau and the fourth one that is x of t that is linearly convolved with u of t minus t naught that is equal to integral of minus infinity to plus infinity x of tau u of t minus t naught minus tau into t tau that is u of t minus t naught minus tau is equal to 1 when t minus t naught minus tau is greater than or equal to 0 that is t minus t naught is greater than or equal to tau where tau is less than or equal to t minus t naught tau should not be greater than t minus t naught hence we can write that integral of minus infinity to plus infinity sorry tau upper limit is t minus t naught x of tau into d tau it's proved